Thank you for joining me, The Blobber here, as we continue our new Blue Blob campaign. We are improving with Muscovy so that he doesn't accidentally reject our um, request to integrate his land at the end of it, because that would be awkward. We're going to war with Poland, nominally to actually feed a little bit to Muscovy, but mostly with the intention of taking land from the co-belligerent to Lorraine. The last of the French region that we need to complete the original basic level of this uh, Reddit challenge, which is to, as a blue nation, conquer the entire French region. You can't be France. No custom nations, blah 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 blah. Lots of elaborate rules that we went over at the start. But for those of you joining Midway, or, well this is actually much closer to the end than Midway, but for those of you joining us now, you get an idea of what, what's going on and why. I would rather the people influence. Muscovy comes and reinforces and then we win. Now we find out if we can piece him out separately for those two last little bits of the French region that we need. To which the answer seems to be yes. Why have you joined? <laughs> Austria own you. Good for them. Okay, now, Lorraine, if I said I would let you out for these, you would say thank you. Beautiful. Don't want that for what? Now that will doubtlessly have caused an arse load of overextension. Just look at them. Yeah, and an arse load of aggressive expansion for taking taking land from a prince without doing it properly. Meh, we've got enough big friends that we don't really need to worry. Now, will you give me what I want, which is just those three? No. Nope. Well, the pain continues then. Speaking of the pain continuing, let's go find some of these guys to kill. Ooh, he might let us out. Oh, that's not his capital. Mm, we can go get that. You ate the Papal State, you bastard. You were just going to give it back, though, probably. Although I said that about Naples, and they didn't give it back, so... Naples did not return Rome. They are naughty boys. I don't want much. Thank you. Because he's just going to re-ally Lithuania. 
and we're going to get pulled in against him for Lithuania again. And that's actually made it so that he's kind of winning, which is nice. Hopefully he pieces out before he... before. Hopefully the Teutons piece out before uh, Poland. Build up a force again. And that will have also bumped out the integration time on him a bit. But he's already coring them all. Fifty-one liberty desire. Why? Why? What did I ever do to you? Relative power, my backside. We'll come sit on these two to stop them rebelling against us. We can get the cheapest one. It's also that he's better at Diplotech than me. Because I've been spending so much mana integrating him. Anyway. We can help fix this by getting a larger army, but I can't get a larger army. Hmm. Then we'll just do it the old-fashioned way by improving. Oh, I can also threaten Denmark when? Five years? Five years. And Lithuania when? Four years. Until then, we just sit here improving with him. Stupid Cossack raids. Wait. No, we're all good. Speed up. Recall. So that's as high as that's going to get that way. I can... No, that's not going to be enough. The different religion penalty is too big at the moment. If I ally though, it's 50. And I need to get to 150 from... 190 for vassalization. I could go Alliance, Access, Gift, and that's about it. Well, tough luck. Um, has the Pope started to exist somewhere else? No, no he has not. I can do that to help increase the rate at which he integrates and these were super expensive even with claims because they were just such high development re-up with Austria and Castile check out the Game of Thrones just the Teutons let's guess you want us to go to war with the Ottomans <sighs> what do you want this time? Fine, have that, I don't care. You do all the work.
So we're actually getting towards the cap on how much I can improve his relationship. And he's still actually fairly liberty desirous. Like, if he gets one more tick of that... It could be very troubling, troubling for us. Come on, Poland. Lose. Give in. Oh, I didn't realize I had a fort there. Oops. He concentrates on me while I concentrate on ignoring him. <laughs> Lithuania is two years, not even two years. General. They, these event generals are usually super generals. Yeah, four, four, three, four. That is amazing. She got it up top and she got it at the bottom. That much siege is just really rare. Really, really rare. Improve with Austria. Well, that seems unlikely. But whatever. Go sit together there. We don't actually need a navy over here anymore. So these guys can come and join the others. And that I cancelled my accesses here. Yes, good. strength of our faith is unquestionable. Uh, sorry. does it last? If it lasts 20 years, if it lasts 10 years, if it lasts 10 years then the bourgeoisie are okay. Because then all of those will elapse at basically the exact same time and we can start giving them provinces back. Oh, time to start the next wave. One, two, No, that one's okay. Yoink, I would like more tax income.
these are basically fixed, so let's try and see if we can let them cross. Lithuania is only a couple of months away now. Are you re-allied with them? I bet you are. Yup. Holy shit. Well done, no guy. But I want Lithuania dead. They got a province. Yeah, yeah, we knew those were coming. Yoink, you're finished. Come on, nine heavies. him nothing. Did he just get like the newest level of... Oh, yes. The newest level of... Oh, yes. Boats or something? Let's see if we can upgrade all our boats. Yes. See what that does for us. And we'll build a couple more. That many. His troops are already across, so it doesn't matter. Truth of Lithuania! Boom, boom, boom! You join. Stupid lazy. Anyway. He finds himself suddenly unable to move. And we... What do we do? What do we do? Uh, you're maxed? Yeah, we could go up with Naples. Yeah, look, we almost ran out of upping with Naples. Oh, we've got new infantry. Sure thing. What was that? Was that we became the Curia? Yes! Um, now, it might be time to think about trying to become the Emperor. Which was one of the last things that we can do. We can culture convert everything away now that we own all of the Sweden things from French and we can become the Emperor as the last two things for the Reddit challenge. In the meantime, can I find anyone who I can already uh, excommunicate? No. <laughs> After 1650, religious influences on the... <laughs> on politics have decreased to such a degree that this action would not be taken seriously. What does that even mean? I'm serious, what does it mean? It means that you just can't do it. Okay. Fair enough.
these two aren't needed there, they're better off helping here. Old men, hold. Yep, wrecked. Brutal. Oh, but what do you know, it's time to end the episode. So, this episode we re-improved with Muscovy because they were like, Wah! Wah! I want my freedom! Briefly. And we finally got the last of the French region. So, or was that last episode? Did we just wait? In any case, we're so close to the end now. We just need to become the Emperor and to culture convert everything away from French in Gascony, which we will do once we complete religious and get this 25% per cost reduction and we'll go activate the policy for another 20% and we'll culture convert everything away from French. We've got 100 years to do it, 140. We should easily be able to do so. In any case, I hope you've enjoyed watching and will join us again soon. Bye-bye.